I've just discovered a whole new beverage that I didn't know existed. Okay, so what do we need? This is so cool. <laughs> I'm gonna get the stuff and we're gonna make it right here. No more, it's joining. The random Instagram challenge. You guys seem to appreciate these. You said that they were chill. So let's just chill. Let's just <laughs> sit back, have a chill. Uh, grab yourself a drink, grab yourself a little snack, a little something to eat. This is your time off. Let's enjoy some random Instagram hashtags together. Chill. We generate a random word, designing, and we search for it in the hashtags on Instagram, and we have a look at the posts. Mmm, very interesting, very cool. Look, this is a sink. Whoa, did you guys see that? <laughs> That's kind of cool. You can't control how much water comes out though. I guess that's a problem. You see, because who would have thought to search up the hashtag designing and we never would have found such a cool tab. So, um, that's the premise. Gig. Nice voice. Cool gig. Imperfect. What do we have? Almost perfect. New tat. Oh gosh. I don't mind it. <laughs> it's just weirdly placed. Like it looks like everyone's forever gonna be looking at this spot on his stomach. It feels like on your arm, like if it was like a smaller version like here or something, you know, I'd be I'd be down. We got some selfies of people who are hashtag imperfect. Eight. <laughs> <laughs> the heck did I just watch? Alarm. Person with a heart. Breakfast. We got some fire. We got some peeps. 102 likes. It wasn't that guy who posted it. Has to be one of the girls. Yeah. <laughs> Guys just don't get that many likes on their Instagram photos. You got a big bunch. It's a lot of people. Looks like you guys had fun there. I'm happy for you. Hypocrite. <laughs> this is, this is I'm 14 and this is deep. So true. Hashtag sheep. Hashtag mask. Hashtag fake. Hashtag false. Hashtag beauthentic. Ah. Oh. <laughs> be, be authentic. Cool. Not bad, not bad. Some people use the word hypocrite. I like to use the word hypocrite. You can take that one. Paperback. Oh, we're just gonna get some photos of people's books that they're reading. There's a book, 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 book on a pillow, book, book. Approaching. It's the strange ones that give you the good content. Calling it now. Yeah, we got flights. Here's some flight footage. From inside the cockpit, no less. I mean, that's pretty cool, right? Heh <laughs> guys. Whoa, look how fast it's coming. That doesn't even look real. Wait, is it real? No, it's not real. Okay, it's not real. It's a simulator. That, <laughs> okay, virtual pilot. Form. We have a naked lady. We've got two dudes. We have a line. It's okay. Like, could have used some smoothing on the keyframes. Motion's a bit rigid. Like, it reminds me of uh, Pivot Stick Figure Animator. Do you guys remember that? Oh, yeah. These videos are so satisfying. It could just anything clay is so satisfying. Look at that. Keep going, dude. All the way down. Don't let it end before you get to the bottom, please. Oh, yeah. Out. 16 and a half million posts. Whoa, did you get those shoes? Rainbow camo. Useful for undercover leprechauns. Why are they all using hashtag out? <laughs> Startle. There we are, we can see. Jack. Oh! Jack. Jack. Oh! <laughs> oh! Cheesy! Happy birthday, Jim! Oh my gosh! Oh! 
Oh, that scared me to death. <laughs> it's like a surprise party for one. Wait, is there like a Urban Dictionary random, random? There is, it's a thing <laughs> slash random. It's gonna be tough because we're gonna have to avoid some of the more uh, promiscuous words. Like uh, the first one here, maybe the second one as well. A delicious Mexican rice drink. Horchata. So you add cooked rice, brown sugar, sugar, salt, cinnamon, cold milk. Ten out of ten would recommend adding some dark rum. Guys, I know this was an Instagram video, but like, <laughs> what? I've just I've just discovered a whole new beverage that I didn't know existed. Okay, so what do we need? It seems fairly like you just pick the proportions you want and yeah, put it in a blender and mix it up. A rice drink. This is so cool. <laughs> I'm gonna get the stuff and we're gonna make it right here. Welcome to Joinin's bar. Here we have a blender. It's the only tool we need in this bar. Today we have one drink on the menu. It is the or or horchata, or horchata, or horchata. Okay, many of you may not have heard of this before. I certainly haven't. Uh, now listen, as I explain to you, as if I have some authority on this, how to make one, when I've never made one in my life. You're gonna wanna get some rice, just some leftover rice that you've cooked the night before. It's probably not worth cooking up new rice just to make one of these. But we don't know, it might be amazing. About a cup per person. Chuck that straight in. That, that's a half a cup. Gotta make this a full cup. Rice in a bar drink? Who would have known? Make sure it's cool. You don't want hot rice, okay? You're gonna wanna add some white sugar and some brown sugar. I don't know why, but you just gotta believe me. Now this is all to taste, maybe, some white. I have no idea what I'm doing. Just, just a light dash of cinnamon in there, just for a little bit of flavor. I'm gonna add my own little secret uh, addition of a little bit of vanilla here. Other than that, the Instagram post said to add some rum. So we've got some uh, rum, a dash of rum. Now, we add, um, We're ready to go. You're gonna wanna grab a glass of ice. I prepared one earlier and pour it straight in. Oh, that looks good. Make sure to dash the top with some extra cinnamon. And there you go, a horchata. This has been joining the drink man. Uh, I'll catch you next time when we make a drink. And we're back. Now there's this drink in front of me. Let's watch it one more time before I taste it. Oh, I forgot to sieve it. Hi, welcome back to my drink kitchen where we forget to sieve things. Now you will gonna want to, uh, I got, you guys have a bowl, a little sieve, and uh, once you've already poured it into the cup and it looks all nice, then just uh, sieve it. Oh gosh, I'm making a mess. Oh gosh, this doesn't work. Now that you have it in a bowl, <sighs> um, tip it back in. Now that you have only a small portion of the drink you just had, you're free to enjoy it. Honesty is key. I severely stuffed up with that process of just trying to like, 
trying to use the world's smallest sieve to in a bowl, then back out, trying to save the ice cubes because they're the only that hadn't freezed extra ice cubes. That was a grueling task. <laughs> Make sure to use the sieve first. Don't do what I did. Anyway, um, now I can finally try it. The rum really um, is good. The It's like a, it's exactly what you would expect it to taste like. It's like a rice milkshake. I don't know if you guys have rice porridge where you're from. In Finland, we have risi puro. It tastes like a cold blended risi puro <laughs> with rum. <sighs> I'll see you tomorrow.